Okay. So. Here we go. Bloop, bloop. And. What do we get? Fairies, elves, angels, goblins, undead, and demons have gained tremendous power thanks to the secrets of the realm. What secrets? Their abilities are now unmatched. Seek them once again. You are ready, and their power will be yours. Uh, does that mean they're going to become more awesome than mercenaries? Well, I'll just scoop up all these new things. I'm trying to remember what time it is so that maybe I'll take a crack at this. Um, elves are just ridiculous. I have zero gems. It's producing this much. Anyway, maybe I'll take a crack at this equality thing of 24 hours in each faction. Oh, hey, look at that. There's a thing I could get for not being assigned to anybody. Okay. Alright, I have sought them again. The Elvis, Ma the Elvis faction has a mission for you, Your Majesty. Check the upgrades panel to view it. Okay. Where's the upgrades panel? Wait, oh, here, right, of course, it's right in front of me. One E a hundred coins? That's a lot. Hello, Melon Amin. Well, Melon is welcome, according to the Hobbit. We require a new place to train our soldiers, build enough warrior barracks, and we'll make them worthy of you. But I have to get to 1E100. Well. Fine. Maybe the goblins will talk more sense. We'll go visit them. Huh. Nope. Still one. Hmm. Definitely something new available to dig up. Alright. So. Tell me, goblins, what sort of thingy do you have for me? I want E100 coins. Ah! Oh. Well, um, hmm. Hey there, we need a safe place to keep our honestly earned savings. <laughs> we'll turn those witch conclaves into something more useful, if you build enough of them. Yeah, we'll just evict all the witches and just store all of our money there. I can't see anything wrong with that plan. There's no way that could ever possibly bite us in the butts. Ah, well. I guess I get to start recording again when I actually have 1E100. Then we'll see what these factions have for us. I noticed the Titans didn't get anything. So apparently this is not all of the uh, things that say research on them. Where is it? Where's research? Yeah, any of these research things. However, there was something somewhere that says... I mean, it's still a blank one here. Somewhere I have something that said something about level two spells or something crud I don't remember it I don't see it ah <sighs> I'd swear I saw somewhere mention of level two spells and I haven't unlocked that yet that might be what this is though just maybe anyway so we'll pick up when I can actually afford to unlock the new unlock Where'd it go? It disappeared when I selected Drow. I can't have the Drow or the Dwarves in play. I have to reach 1E100 without those. Oh. Well, now that's a little bit more difficult. 
but I can do it. It's not, it's not that hard. And the next reincarnation gives me nothing new. Oh, well, research points. This is connected to research. Alright, I've tested it repeatedly, and I believe that I can get to a thousand, a thousand excavations in less than 30 seconds. I've been wanting to use this to boost it, but it's just failing me again, so, I don't know. So, no boost from that, but I'm pretty sure I can do this, and if I fail, I'll have wasted a ton of excavations and have to wait till I reincarnate to try again. Here goes. Okay, buy all. Gem. Here, 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 here. Buy. Elves. Up, 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 up. Just do those. Buy those. Up, 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 up. Buy all. We still good? 19 seconds. We've got 10 left. And a thousand. Ah, I did it. And I got a thing. Van vanilla flavored juice. Vanilla flavored juice? That's a huge boost to all vanilla factions. What's a vanilla faction? Is that like good and evil without actually choosing elf or berry? Or is that... I don't, I don't know what that means. Still, it's a pretty good big boost. Uh, didn't do anything there. Okay, whatever. And... That excavated quickly. Okay, let's see. Okay. I want to see the boost of this vanilla thing. Okay, it's not here. I also want to see what that excavated quickly does for me. No, that's just Realm Digger. Hmm, I'm not seeing anything. Hmm. Hmm. Over here. Oh, by the way, we're ready to do the uh, new challenges that I unlocked. Or not challenges, the, 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 the things. I built up enough stones, I can finally do that. Where's the vanilla? Hmm. Alright. Well, oh, there it is. Okay, so it boosts me here, so we're going for this, and I can't use dwarves or this will go away. And that's, okay, and that's the vanilla boost went away too, I see. Okay, so what it means is no dwarves, no elves, or no drow. No underdark dwellers allowed. So we're going to start with the elves and this vanilla boost thing is um, very timely very very nice must have been something I couldn't have dug up before or something but yeah the timing of it couldn't be better so I'm at a hundred why can't I have you do I need more warrior barracks it just says one E100 coins, and then it talks about building building warrior barracks. Hmm. Take that. Well. Oh, I should probably do this. Ah, can I grab eh, 40 of them? That's, that's good enough. Yes, I know, somebody's going to complain that I used 40 of them at once. <laughs> And used it, but I just blew a thousand to get an achievement, which I don't even I don't even know what it does yet because it hasn't actually shown up. It's gonna do something nice for me eventually. Okay. 
So that, oh, there we go. Okay, it was definitely, you needed a certain number of warriors and the money, which, why even make it cost 1E100? E That's confusing. It was, you needed more than that to buy the, all right, what do you do? Excellent, you can now upgrade your warrior barracks to elven training grounds in the upgrades panel. By doing this, you will unlock your first research facility and a whole new way to customize your... You permanently unlocked a unique building for the Elven Faction. Okay, okay. Boosting your... Uh, per boosting their production based on the total amount of clicks you've made and unlocking more unique perks. This allows access to facilities, but it will prevent you from joining a prestige faction unless you've discovered the secrets of the underworld. I want the secrets of the underworld. That sounds awesome. Okay. By prestige faction, you met, um, you met dwarves, right? Car carpentry? A craftsmanship research. Unlock the craftsmanship research facility. It increases elven production by 100,000% plus an additional point bonus based on craftsmanship research point these 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 upgrades will persist through abdication and reincarnations providing a permanent bonus to all factions affected okay and these are now producing 98 percent of all of my wealth and it's growing based on clicks so um so wow okay um um i don't know quite fully what the implications of this are yet uh i, I guess i can turn my other buildings green um hmm so you're getting bigger and bigger just over time with the clicks i want this but the Dwarven option is gone. Huh. The Dwarves fin- uh, the, the Elves finally booted those boisterous Dwarves out. Breaking all their laws. <laughs> Disturbing them with their drunken singing all through the night. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm playing the Elves as though they were snooty. How else are you gonna play Elves? Um, well, I kind of want to dig for this. Oh, there we go. Increase your chance to find faction coins with excavations is increased by an additional 5%. That's great, except that you come in really late. <laughs> oh, well. So, carpentry seems to be the only thing unlocked. Before I go checking out what the, uh, demons and you know drow well actually no not drow they won't get in on this before i go inspecting the demons and goblins and such i need to find out this it says it increases elven production and these upgrades will persist at uh, providing a permanent bonus to all factions affected elven production all factions affected Affected. Does elven production include drow elven production? Oh! Purchasing this facility has allowed us to access a new research panel. Let's open it! Here you can view and manage the research system. You have unlocked the spellcraft branch. To view and improve all existing branches, you'll need to unlock their facilities first. First of all, you need to invest coins and faction coins into a branch in order to gain research points in that branch. By doing so, you will see that more and more upgrades appear in that category. However, you will likely not be able to purchase them yet, because you are poor. You have to, oh, oh, unlock requirements. So there's a colored background, which ingrates, let's see, black indicates that you have unlocked the research and it is available for purchase. Okay, light green indicates a purchased research. Oh, ah, crap, no, I, um, 
An olive background indicates a research that you can unlock with your current faction, although you haven't done so yet. You can see a, progr a progress percentage number in its description. Finally, a red background indicates an insert that you uh, research that you've unlocked, but you cannot purchase with your current faction. Okay, I, stop skipping when I click. I clicked one time. <sighs> the number of researches that you can buy in an individual branch are limited. You start with a limit of four per branch, but there'll be ways to gain additional research slots. Okay, and the elf thing said it gave me one more, right? Hmm. Increases elven production by zero percent. <laughs> hmm. Okay. As much as I want to play with that, let's wander over to some of our others. Okay. Let's try goblins. Oh, once more, I am the Goblin King. Whoa -ha -ha. So I'll just take all of that, load up on these. Load up on these. Okay, what do you guys want again? Oh, right. Right. Witch conclaves. Oh, that was easy. I permanently unlocked their building. Oh, there it is. Goblin bank. Just, just throw the witches out. We'll just build banks. Can throw them in the swamp with Shrek. That's where all the witches can go. Boosting the base production based on the amount of gold you own and unlocking more unique perks for the building. So, the more gold that I hold on to, the more the Goblin Bank will give me. Hmm. So all the way down here is a third building down. Again, it's producing most of my money now. What is this? Exchequer unlocks the economics research facility and increases goblin production. Uh, all the other same words below it. The economics research facility. Wow. Goblins don't really need me to spend money on excavations. We, with goblin greed, we got all the faction coins we could want. Though I do, I do lust after whatever artifact is buried here. I want it, but we'll worry about that later. Okay. Boop. All right. I need a lot more money. Okay. Once this fills up, we've got this. I think. Maybe. No, I'm sure we've got this thing. I know my goblins. They can... They can add five zeros to my, my cash on hand. Besides, this will get bigger as I, as I get more money, and that'll help me get more money. <laughs> yeah, this will totally work. Why is there a little lock there? Or is that a... It looks like a padlock. Hmm. Wish I could add this to the mix, but I cannot. Okay. Kathum. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Do, do, do. Click. Click, 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 click. I'll take those. Uh, I have enough. I swear I have enough. Oh, 26 goblin coins? Oh, 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 fine. Is that good enough? Thank you. I'll take that. See, see, but both of these say, like, elven production and goblin production. I, I want... I want more! <laughs> You're late. I, I already did that. All right, 
whatever. One more run up this. Yeah, not even, not even close. That's fine though. Okay. See, I don't know what these are actually doing for me. Well, all right. Let's do the fairies. Oh, wait. Actually, let's really do the fairies. Let's do them right. Come on. I've got... I get so spoiled by having that elven thing active all the time. It's okay, though. <laughs> I can do... I can handle not having it for a couple of runs now and then. Come on. Okay. Hey, listen! No, it's Navi! A true fairy never has enough farms. We will offer you the chance to improve them. Fairies love farms. I, I'd have never known that before. I thought they liked living in the woods. Uh, fairies around here like to live in the woods. Okay. We need to get at all of these, but we don't have. But the fairy chanting. Okay, yes. Okay. How close are we? Not close enough. Pour them out! Our faction coins. Alright, we can do this in one gulp. Once our mana tops off. probably overestimating my... No, I'm not overestimating the fairies. They're like ants with wings. Wait, ants already have wings. Anyway, they can lift a hundred times their weights. Is it a hundred times? Or is it more like ten bajillion times? I forget how strong an ant is relative to its body. One of those facts that my mind just goes as a lot and then doesn't bother to, to remember the number. <laughs> Okay. All right. And this only lasts for 10 seconds. Tripled. And then that. Crap, I did this all wrong. Oh, well, I got enough. I'll buy all those. Yay. Um, not good enough yet. Oh, wait, no, there we go. Okay, enchanted field as in the farm slot, and it's the farms in the blacksmiths that everything they have boosts. Boosting production based on the amount of assistance you own. Hmm. That's a crazy boost. That's like a lot. Unlocks the Spellcraft Research Facility and increases fairy production. Yes, yes, okay. The Spellcraft Research Facility. Okay, cool. Let's get ourselves that. Oh, man. So... Yeah. Okay. Right. Hmm. Guess I'd better run down these. Okay. We need this. We'll have it in a second. This is just... Put it on this. I mean, if I can get the mercenaries to have this, if I can just give them this field, I mean, good grief. They'd be, like, a bajillion times more powerful. In fact, the fairies might be better than the mercenaries. We'll know in a second if I can get this past 64. Okay, maybe maybe not that good. Maybe not better than the mercenaries good. But these... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. 
So doing it right this time. Call to arms. Don't need the clicking reward really. Okay, boom. Yes, sure, I'll take that. Boost my faction coin fine chance. Perfect. That's exactly what I need. Because I need to get to 1e1 e, well, e six now. All right. Oh, I'll buy all those. All of them. Yes, I do that some that way sometimes. It lets me give a more even spread. It matters more when you have Druid Heritage, but at least I have the Fairy ability that's giving me max MP for buildings. Fortunately, this one looks like it's going to be pain and slower. So, I'm going to just kind of... All of these are presumably going to be the same. So, I'm just going to kind of jump around showing the rest of the research facilities. Unlock one at a time here. And then... Uh, then we'll see about actually investing in these and uh, see it says craftsman research 0 out of 136 and this is a 0 out of 136 as well but then down the bottom it goes you purchased 0 of 4 upgrades in this branch hmm there is much to investigate here angels Bless you, dear friend. The lands of the sky are expanding. As more good souls are joining our ranks, would you be so kind as to provide them a place to stay in the heavens? And... Whoop. So now we get... a huge boost to that, as these are boosting uh, by such and such for each spell affecting them. Which, let's go ahead and uh, I had stuff auto casting spec towards getting uh, faction coins because I needed them. Pantheon. Now I note that at this point I could still pick up dwarves. It's not until I click this that I get locked out. Unlocks the divine research facility. Um, yeah, and it's kind of the same, same looking stuff as the others. So how is this any different from the economics one? Heck if I know. But I got the spellcraft research off of fairies. And we're going to get this one off of this. Fortunately, it's still just a tad out of reach. But not for long. Because angels do one thing extraordinarily well. And that is obviously mana okay boost there and there it is looking just like the others we'll be back to actually spend these points but my next target mm, yeah no we're just gonna move on my next target shall be Demons. <clears throat> Hello there. The dead stand ready. Give them a place to rise and live again. Build enough necropolises. We'll take care of the rest. I can't quite decide what's going on in this picture. Seems to be some form of skull with bone spikes or bone ears. Something behind it. Whatever it is, it's a... Uh, Oh, what is this? Under cities. Which is not the same as the secrets of the underworld, apparently, but okay. So, un necropolises to under cities. Boosting production based on the time spent in this game. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. And that has given us alchemy research which is very strange because alchemists labs are among the neutrals that's 
most peculiar. On to the final one. We have but a single target remaining. Also, I did, you may have noticed, get some more uh, gems because, well, frankly, the undead, I, I looked at them and went, ugh, this is going to take forever. I need more gems. Which I have now. And the... Did I already do demons? No, I didn't do demons. The demons should be very, relatively very easy. Relatively very easy. Yeah, that was a stupid sentence. Okay. Useless underling, be warned! The demons are going to invade your world with all their might. If you know which side you want to be on when that happens, build those hell portals! I think I've heard that one before. Okay, I did it. And our building is the Infernal Realm. Hell portals become Infernal Realms, boosting their production based on trophies. Oh, well, this one should be especially good. Why are demons obsessed with trophies? Uh, I never knew that was a thing until now. Huh. Demons and their trophies. I think it would be the fairies or the goblins that would be attracted to shiny things. Hmm. Or sure. Guess I'll go with this, 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 and these. Oh, I don't think those. Boop. Strategy room. That's what we were looking for, right there. And all I need is some coins. Boop. For science. Increase the production of all your buildings by 100% when you can access research. Okay. Ah, I should have guessed there'd be a secret trophy in there for just having them all. Okay, we have a full set. At last. What do we want to research? I guess we'll do demon. Okay. Increase demon production. Increase the production of infernal realms based on the number of hellfire blasts. This game, but that doesn't count as an upgrade. That's just by default. So I can just do this. Okay. Oh well, I mean, I guess that's true. Pooh. We won't get to investigate all of those just yet. How do these affect the mercenaries? That's what I want to know. All right. Well, I only have one option. I can't scroll up or down either. Well? Well? Oh, I can scroll up and down. Where are my other options? That's it? Well, I mean, that's nice, but that's not really all that special. Oh, well. Hmm. Hey, I got a thousand help or, or yeah, I apparently never had done that before. Um, so what do I do from here? Do I try to just amass more money in the demons and hope for another research to pop out? Do I abdicate and come back and find a new one? How does this work? And does this benefit... No, it can't benefit anything because it names Infernal Realms, so it's a demon-only thing. No matter how I look at it, I just don't understand. This is not what I was expecting at all. I was expecting the research to be like, I don't know, I, I kind of expect it to be like a big old wall of things with trees on them, you know, a skill tree kind of thing with research things and you put points into it. And I was not expecting this faction-based um, 
thing. I, I don't know. I, I just wasn't expecting this. I don't know quite what to make of it. Ah, but buying this upgrade boosted the base production of demons. Hmm. That's interesting. Hmm. You guys really need to be able to use ser spiritual surge. You know that? Hmm. <sighs> I guess my next step is to buy at least one upgrade in each, um, what just, what? Ah, uh, hmm, ah, uh, okay. A faction doesn't know how to research these. I can just click it and boost it further. That's what happened. It spent coins boosting each of these. I have a 4,000% boost right now and I can take in flame. Increases the production of all other buildings by 110% per <laughs> That doesn't do much. Oh, wow, that does lots of the Hall of Legends. Well, and that was out of divine research. There's an exclamation point on this one and this one and that one. What does that mean? It gives me a 80%, 80% of what? What do I need to do? Okay. Well, the next logical option would be to try another one. Okay. Okay, guys, got to get those training grounds. Yeah. Now then. Okay, so the boosts are still in play, so I've got that boost. Okay, I need more money, that's why. Oh, it's not that much money. I can get that easy. Must be. Okay. So. It's a pretty big boost. That exclamation point's still there. This one's already. Oh, right, because that's. Yeah. Oh, okay. Increase the production of all other buildings based on elven training grounds again. So. So. That wasn't nearly as dramatic as when the uh, demons did that. So I have yet to see anything that overlaps that every faction can use, but I have no doubt we'll see stuff like that. Hmm. What do I need to get further in these? That is the question. That and still wondering how this all impacts mercenaries, of course. Very curious about that. Let's see what a massive boost Nothing, nothing unlocking. Buy that. One of these could be based on the number of excavations. It's the problem. They could be based on virtually anything. I've got no hints. I've just got percentage markers. <sighs> well, this is interesting. Let's try the fairies next. Increase the production of things based on mana produced this game. Man, I could game that with the mercenaries. 
That one's always open. Hmm. Aha! This one's at an. No. Oh, oh. No, it's not the number of buildings, it's specifically the number of farms. See that? Gotcha. Increase the production of inns and blacksmiths based on the enchanted fields. Rather than boosting all my buildings, you'll only boost these two. Hmm. Okay. Oh, here, let me cure that. And get all those while I'm at it. Okay. All right. Should be able to do it now. But the real question is just I mean, I've got a lot of questions, I guess. But I want to know how these will affect when I've got more of them unlocked, how they'll interact. Oh, hello. So, increase maximum mana and mana regeneration based on time spent this game. So this is based on maximum mana, perhaps? I bet that's what it was. Well, I'm definitely going to scoop this one up. Maybe every faction can get this one, Vacuum Mancy. Okay, Vacuum Mancy is a very silly name. But whatever, I can get behind it. Give me my Vacuum Mancy. I doubt I'm gonna figure out how to unlock these at the moment, so let's just Let's just go ahead and do this. Huh. Okay, good enough. Let's move on. Tem templates? Why would I want to save templates of this? There's definitely more going on here than I've figured out. Definitely. Okay. Does my Vacuumancy apply when I play another faction? Does it? Is it? It is, isn't it? No, because I haven't bought it yet. But I can buy it. I've opened it. By buying them once, I open them, and then they're unlocked. Okay. All right. We need... We need the goblins. Come, my people. My goblin minions. Your king commands you. Please, production of gravel banks. Yeah, we'll take that. But I'm limited to four, but I choose which four each time out of the sets. Yes, okay, I think I get it now. Okay. Huh. Well, you guys better unlock something else. Come on, unlock this alchemy thing. I don't know how, I don't know what it is, I don't know how it unlocks, but you guys gotta do it. This'll do it. Come on! Boy, some of them could be based on the number of upgrades you buy. There's so many things it could be based on, you know? Now look at this 1, 10, 25, 30. What does all that mean? Well, of course I'm going to take that. Uh, 
Um, I'll talk that too. Hmm. Come on, come on, gimme, gimme, gimme. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Oh, I don't see any reason why I couldn't have this. I have farms. I wonder if I can even access this when playing neutral or mercenary. Probably not. Increase the production of all buildings based on tax collections, Gast. Well, funny thing about goblins. Every time I cast anything, it's a tax collection. All right. Um, I think I gotta have it now. We haven't even got enough money for abdications yet. Is one of these open for me? No. Thought you had a red circle on you. Okay. So, boom, boom. Come on. I'm staring at this over here. Still not done. Come on. Was it was it amount of gold? Okay. It's definitely the goblin banks. Cause it's a ninety-five. Still at ninety-five. So it's either, well, I mean, it might be the witches that the goblin banks replaced, I guess, maybe. Okay. So if I put more points into these. Oh, oh, 30. So if I clicked on them more. It's, so this is, okay, so this was 1, 10, 25. But this one was a 30 at the same level. Now, how does that happen? So much that's strange. Also, the max mana grows really slowly compared to mana regeneration. Isn't that a little bit backwards? Just a little? Progress, 4,000 max mana? What does that mean? I don't have 4,000 max mana. That's not even the highest max mana I've ever seen, either. Ugh, I am so confused. I am so confused. All right, let's end this video with a few more forays into other other races on this, because the goblin things. I'm, I'm at 95, it's frustrating, but that last bit is just gonna be, it's just gonna be a pain to get to. So I might as well just do this. See if that helps any. All right, moving on. What have we not done yet? Did I do angels? Let's do, let's check out the angels and then, uh, then the undead, which maybe they'll get better. Let's, let's do the undead first. Let's hit the hard one. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Production of undercities based on number of assistants owned. I feel like a broken record, but man, the mercenaries could 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 really, really tear the place up with that. Hmm. Okay. I haven't unlocked anything else. Yet. Oh, okay, that's at ninety six percent still. Hmm. Does that mean I? What does that mean? <laughs> it's it's open, so it's possible for you to unlock. Maybe under cities are boosting it. Maybe it's your special building getting that high. I'm left to speculate in the dark. It was. It was based on special buildings that you had. Ah.
Okay, and if that applies to everyone's special building, that'll be the biggest boost we've gotten. But I'm not seeing anything else that I'm making any progress in, so we're just going to... 42? Whatever that was about. That 42 was probably just, just my researchers reading too much Douglas Adams. And I think, oh, no, no, not that. And I think angels, and then we'll have one final question that I can try to get an answer to today. And I want it to be how to get the secrets of the Underdark, but I don't even know how to ask the game that question, so instead... Mm -hmm. Hmm. Oh, never mind. I, nothing. I'm just crazy. I thought I saw something that I must have not seen. I thought I saw the dwarf thing, and then I pushed by all, and it got bought. But that that can't be. That's, that's impossible. Oh, um. Thank you. Much better. Now we have the mana to get somewhere. I like the crazy amount of mana that these guys generate. <sighs> okay. Increase the production of heaven main based on the total time with at least one active spell. Okay. Close. Yeah. Close though, okay. But if I if I could even open this tab with the mercenaries, I could pour into these. I could pour so much into them. Alright, we'll hit that one. Faster. Faster. More mana. Get a holy light in there too. I guess I should. May as well. Because we got those clicks going. <laughs> okay. Ah. Fomp, fomp. Oh, but I can't get this. Okay, no, it's sticking to necropolises. Now, I thought it was Goblin Banks. It must have been Necropolis's recycling. <laughs> Great. Uh-huh. Plague. Assault. Dueling. War funds. Uh, dummy targets. Cultivation. But how do I unlock all these others? How do I do it? Mm. All right, final question. And I have a feeling it's going to be a resounding nope, but we got to try. Neutral. Okay. No research tab. I didn't think so. I can't invest in research while I'm Titans. And. Mercenaries. Come on, guys. You can you can trust me. Er. Look, I'm buying fairy things. I'm I'm totally with the fairy faction right now. I'm buying all their things. See? See? You can trust me with a little fairy research, can't you? Huh? Please? Yeah, this is about what I was expecting. <sighs> the only way to advance the factions is within the factions. <sighs> 
and only they can make use of the researches and you're not going to what are research points what what are research points up to 153 what do you mean what let me take a look into the research again elves you're so ridiculous how fast you are but I'm gonna miss the drow and the dwarves there bye see it's still there doesn't go away when I push by all it does strange okay so It's on the top, 46 out of 136. That's how many res that's how many times I can click and buy research in a specific category. 136. Yeah, yeah, that's got to be what's going on, right? Yeah, that's exact. Yeah, plus 17. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I mean, I'm in no danger of getting anywhere near the max. How am I supposed to... Huh. From here, I guess I'll probably just be letting you know as I find ways to get, you know, as, as, as more of these unlock for me and stuff. I am rather mystified by all of this. If I dig up artifacts, maybe that could help. Because I gotta find the, uh... Ooh! Thought. Thought. Um... I can just... just we just want to see... We just want to see... Okay. Okay. Wait, no, fork. One screwed it up. Okay, I'm trying to see specifically I want to get one of the regular factions again because Secrets of the Underdark might be... Oh, you see that? It went away. There's nothing to excavate. There's nothing to excavate the moment I called the drow out. So it's not... There's no artifact to give me a hint. Oh, nope. Didn't mean to click that. Nothing. So the secrets of the Underdark are not buried. Where would they be? Maybe they're not accessible yet. Even though it's stupid to ask the same question twice, I'm gonna go ask the fairies. The fairies. I gave you dwarves. Nothing. I have all the challenges that I'm allowed to do till reincarnation 18. I can't get at it. Once I have the dwarves, I can't get at the research tabs. Mm. Well, Here's where we're at for today. I have a lot to figure out still. Yeah, I've got a lot to figure out still. Anyway, until next time and every time, this is Hadrix signing off.